On its way, Saturday from 2 to 6, general admission, there's a VIP section, which is 1 to 2 to get in early. Actually, the direct link to your tickets is palmbeachsummerbeerfest.com. Here's the key. It's in the cool, air-conditioned comfort of the South Florida Fairgrounds Expo Center, the only beer fest in the country in the summer, by the way, which is inside in the air conditioning. So it's already, Brilliant. already awesome. This is why we chose this venue. So get your tickets there. We're going to be talking to Blue Point Brewery here in a couple of minutes about that. They're part of the event as well. But I just stumbled across this. And a little bit of advanced information you need to know, especially after beer fest, really after any weekend. We should, we, we'll post this online. It's true. These are hangover cures from the stars. So that got my attention. I'm like, all right, what celebrities, first of all, drink? Well, yeah, that's you always wonder that. Yeah, I always wonder that. Absolutely. You never really know. Is it like like just the like the degenerate ones? Like, are we talking about Keith Richards here? <laughs> are we, who are we talking about? Some I think he might... drinks gasoline at this point in time. <laughs> What's... Hey, you know what? Hey, it's working for him. <laughs> so who are we to doubt him? So we're going to give you right now the hangover, the proven, they claim, hangover cures from the stars, starting with, thought this was interesting, Julia Roberts. Anybody else besides me not peg her as a drinker? But she says the secret every single time. This is gross. Find a balance between champagne and carrot juice. That that sounds horrendous. She says it works for me when I alternate between the two. I just got a hangover thinking about it. I was going to say. (laughs) I am not. I am skipping right over that. That is out bad. How about Cameron Diaz? She, I see, is a big partier. Absolutely. There's no doubt at all. And I would trust her with a hangover cure. Yeah. She says, no doubt. It's not even a question when I'm hungover. An egg McMuffin and a beer. You need to drink more of the alcohol you've killed yourself with. Classic hair of the dog story. I think fast food is like the ultimate cure for um, for being drunk. Like when you are drunk, like fast food just tastes so much better. It, it's like it's like you went to Wolf, Wolfgang Puck's. It's the greatest thing you've ever tasted when you're in that condition, oh, yeah. right? Zoe Saldana. Who's fantastic, by the way. She says, before I go to bed, I put Epsom salts into a warm bath and soak for 15 minutes. Oh. The next day, I wake up with half the night erased. Yeah. Um, That's called vodka, Zoe. That's called blacking out, I think. <laughs> yeah, I think you have a bigger issue. <laughs> that's, uh, I don't know about Zoe there. She, 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 she That's a mind eraser. <laughs> but you got to go to, as soon as I saw this name, I said, he's got to know something, right? Ozzy Osbourne. What's Ozzy Osbourne's ultimate hangover cure? This is great. I'm just going to read the whole quote. He goes, over the years, I developed a safe, a fail-safe cure, which is, you know, probably like, Sharon! Sharon! He says, basically, I'd mix four tablespoons of brandy with four tablespoons of port, throw in some milk, a few egg yolks, and, if I'm in a festive mood, some nutmeg. The second I woke, I'd mix it up and down it. The way it works is very clever. You get instantly blasted again (laughs) so you don't feel a thing. Here's what he says, though, at the end. Careful. The only drawback is unless you keep drinking after that moderately, the hangover you eventually catches up with you. It's about a thousand times worse than it would have been otherwise. (laughs) Jesus. So there's Aussie for.